And the Nigerian army has confirmed the killing of 30 rival military groups in the Ukum local government area of Benue State, just as it denied the killings where headsmen related. The commander of Operation Well Stroke and chairman of the Open Grazing Prohibition Enforcement Committee, Major General Son De Igbino Wanhe, made the clarification at a briefing as the state began the enforcement of the ban on open grazing given the expiration of its two week ultimatum. For the non kinetic approach and last yesterday, and I'm assuring you, the security agencies, Operation Wise Stroke, and other security agencies operating within the state will implement the full directive of the state. Apart from the influence in other parts of the state, some specific criminals, I will call them, invaded the local government area and they were causing mayhem. The 14 days ultimatum did not cover those guys. And as I speak to you, Operation White Stroke have brought sanity and no mercy to that local government. It was a clash between them, resulting in the death of their foot soldiers. And we'll be there, we'll see the bodies. And it is not an attack by anybody on community, as some people will want to carry. It's a clash between two militia groups, for whatever reason we don't know. And then I can, I can confirm that our initial visit to the place revealed that about 30 people were killed on both sides. Yesterday, the 14 days, which was issued as the ultimatum to, for armed headers to leave the state, lapsed. The provisions of this law, the anti open grazing law, regardless of your background or wherever you come from, the full weight of the law will be brought to bear on you. I must say this for emphasis. <laughs> 